And I'm quite surprised. I thought they'd be all on their feet today celebrating the Brexit Day. It's six years, Mr Speaker, since that decision was taken. Six years of chaos and misery for this nation. In Scotland, this day is marked with nothing other than dismay, disappointment and simmering resentment. We are a nation taken out of an EU we cherished against our national collective will after being promised that that membership would be safe if we stayed in their union. I celebrate the fact that we left the European Union. I'm not a, I'm not a democracy denier like the Honourable Gentleman. Uh, we, we acknowledge that uh, there was a democratic process. That's why we've uh, uh, delivered on Brexit. Uh, that's why he should acknowledge that uh, at, the, uh, at the last referendum on Scotland's place in the Union, uh, he unfortunately uh, uh, lost, and uh, we are stronger together. He should celebrate democracy and uh, uh, and join us in making the union the union stronger. Uh, the government is getting on with the job. We're delivered this week on the HS2 bill. We're delivering on the cost of living with payments coming uh, uh, quickly to to people, and we're supporting pensioners with uh, disability uh, benefits. But in the meantime, the gentleman, honourable gentleman, talked about job opportunities. There is a job in Scotland available to people who want to engage in bureaucracy. Uh, this week, the SNP, Mr Speaker, uh, came forward with their plan to spend £1.5 billion pounds on administration alone to secure the services of care workers from local authorities, uh, only then to procure care workers' services from the local authorities that they have taken those care workers from. Uh, uh, absolutely bonkers. Uh, they're, they're too busy being distracted by their own sort of Watergate moment where uh, their, their internal meetings have been leaked. Um, they, the, the SNP chief whip was so angry that he wrote to colleagues saying, please don't leak, only for that letter to be, to be leaked. Uh, I, I think the SNP leak more than their ferries. 